he is the greatest Slovak player in history, a Napoli legend with whom he amassed records and trophies. His passing skills are breathtaking and his touch is as neat as his hair. A look back at the career of the one and only Subscribe to Megafoot, the best of football in video. Marek Hamzik was born in July 27, 1987 in Banka Bistrica, a large mining town in central Slovakia. He grew up in a sporting family. His mother, Renata, is a handball player and plays for the city team, while his father, Richard, is the captain of the Slovakian five-a-side football team. The father introduced his son to football at an early age. He enrolled Marek in one of the town's small clubs, Jupi Podlebis. There, the young midfielder was quickly spotted by Slovan Bratislava, the country's biggest club. Marek played his first game with the pros at the age of 16. After six games in the league, he is already attracting attention in Italy. Brescia took a stand and put 500,000 euros on the table to sign the 17-year-old prodigy, the biggest transfer in history for a Slovak player. Marek quickly earned a starting place in Serie B. His vision, passing ability, and 10 goals caught the eye of Napoli scouts, who then made a return to Serie A. Scorer at the Stadio San Paolo, Hamsi joined the Azuri the following summer for a check of 5.5 million euros, the same day as a certain Ezequiel Lebetti. Marek quickly showed his colors, a goal and an assist in his first game at the Coppa Italia against Cesena. Even better, the Slovakian was the club's top scorer in his first season. Now a fan favorite, Hamsi already has a nickname. Maricciaro, in reference to the small fishing port that borders the south of Naples, south of Posilipe. After a promising start, 2010 was a year of confirmation. Hamsik became the cornerstone of Walter Mazzari's system and embodied the renaissance of SSC Napoli. For the first time since 1990 and the departure of Maradona, the Partenope are back in the Champions League. They were down in a tough group with Bayern and Manchester City with Marek Hamsik securing qualification with a sublime volley against Villarreal. The journey would come to an abrupt halt in the first leg of the last eight against the eventual winners, Chelsea. Napoli being far behind Uve in the league, they took the revenge in the Coppa Italia final. An amazing counterattack by Hamsik sealed the victory for the Azuri. It was Napoli's first trophy in 20 years. As he had promised in the event of victory, Marek will even shave his head for the occasion. Whether with or without his famous haircut, Hamsik is at the top of his game. Placed in the heart of the game or higher up in the support of Cavani, Hamsik is the creator of Mazzari's team. He breaks down opposing lines with his passing skills, particularly on lobbed openings. His excellent vision allows him to quickly find the right solution. With his technique and dynamism, he can also make a difference with the ball at his feet. And if he is in a shooting position, he can very well launch a shot, even for more than 25 meters. A complete number 10, capable of making others shine or illuminating a game on his own. Although he forms with Cavani and Lovetsi one of the most beautiful attacking trios in Europe, Napoli are still trailing Juventus in the league. Mazzari left his place to Rafael Benitez, but the keys to the game were always in the hands of Marek Hamzik. Impressive in his consistency and always at the top of his game, the number 17 missed only three Scudetto matches in his first four seasons. When another Napoli legend, Paolo Cannavaro, hung up his boots, he was naturally promoted to captain. Napoli finished third in the league and added another Coppa Italia to their collection after a 3-1 win over Fiorentina. Despite the covetousness of the big clubs, such as Uve and Bayern Munich, and despite a few mishaps in the city, notably two Rolex thefts, including an armed robbery, Hamzik remains loyal to Napoli. He feels so comfortable there that he signed a new four-year contract which binds him to the club until 2020. <laughs> gente sempre sorridente, si mangia alla grande, eh, un po' di tutto, per quello sono ancora qua dopo dieci anni perché Napoli mi è rimasto nel cuore. But Marek does not only make Campania happy. In 2015, it was with Slovakia that he achieved one of the greatest feats of national sport. After a stunning run in which Slovakia beat Ukraine and then Spain, the Blue and Whites finished second in their group and qualified for the first European Cup in their history. And that's how the captain gave his country its first victory in a major competition against Russia. With his level of performance and regularity, Marek Hamzik is erasing one by one the club records. In 2017, in a win over Sampdoria, Hamzik scored his 116th goal for the Azuri 
In doing so, he surpassed the other Napoli idol, a certain Diego Maradona, enough to merit another ovation from the San Paolo public. The following year, he played his 400th game in Serie A. Throughout his career, Mary Chiaro had many songs to his name, from Italian rap and Danish to covers of Lady Gaga and Gangnam Style, which went viral in the San Paolo. In 2019, Marek will bid farewell to Napoli after 12 years and 520 games in the Azzurro shirt. He is now the most capped player in the club's history ahead of Giuseppe Bruscolati. The San Paolo Stadium will never forget the assists and goals and the determination of its captain. Marek then flew to China and the Dalian Club. He spent a season and a half there before returning to the old continent with an unexpected signing at IFK Gothenburg. And at 33, the Slovakian still has some fine skills remaining. In 2021, the Slovak captain will lead his team to its second participation in the European Championships. It was an opportunity for him to write the last pages of his legend. They will remain forever engraved in the hearts of Slovakian fans and even on the walls of Naples. Is Hamsik the greatest player of the Asari? Thank you for watching our video. If you liked it, don't hesitate to talk about our channel around you, to like it, to share it. See you soon for a new video. Ciao!